In this video, I'm going to give you another basic engineer skill that you should know, and that is the six-step problem-solving format for demolitions. Now, I'll give you the steps here first, and then I will run through with you on how to do it. Step one, identify the critical dimensions. Step two, calculate for TNT. Step three, divide by RE factor. Step four, divide by package weight or volume and round up to the next whole package. Step five, calculate the number of charges required. And step six, calculate the total explosives. Now, the calculation I got written out here for you is for the abatis. Now, in the particular one we're going to use for this example, we're going to say we have, and you're going to round on your uh, diameters of the trees, okay? We have eight trees that are 16 inches in diameter, five trees that are 20 inches in diameter, two trees that are 28 inches in diameter. Now we need to calculate four TNT for each of those different types of trees. The calculation for abatis is D squared over 50, the di diameter squared over 50. Now, what it gives us for our amount of TNT required. For the 16 inch trees, we need approximately 5.12 pounds per tree. For the 20 inch trees, we need approximately 8 pounds. For the 28 inch trees, we need 15.68 pounds of TNT. Well, we're not going to be using TNT in this particular blast. We're going to use C4, in particular M112 block. The RE factor for 112 is 1 1.34. And yes, it is different for different types of C4. The uh, M112 C4 block is your standard C4 block. Other types of C4 is it's for your specialty stuff it usually comes out to 1.14 as the RE factor. Now we take our poundage for TNT and we convert it to C4. We come out for the 16 inch trees 3.82 pounds. For the 20 inch trees 5.97 pounds. For the 28 inch trees, 11.70 pounds. So we move on to our next step, which is divide by the package weight or volume and round up. Now, M112 block is one and a quarter pound sticks. So 1.25. So we take our number for the 16 inch trees, which is 3.82. Divide by the package weight, we round up. We need approximately three sticks per tree. Take our 20 inch, it's 5.97. Divide by the package weight, round up. Five sticks per tree. For 28 inch trees, 11.70. Divide by package weight, round up. 10 sticks. Now there is a when you're doing a TNT, you refer to them as blocks. C4, you refer to as sticks. And the reason you refer to it as sticks is because it does have the uh, double-sided tape on one side, so it sticks to the surface. Uh, you also refer to uh, dynamite as uh, sticks also because of its shape. Now we need to calculate the number of charges. We had eight trees at 16 inch diameter, five trees at 20 inch, two trees at 28 inch. So we need 15 total charges. Now, calculate our total explosives. So we're gonna take our eight from the 16 inches, times it by the three. So we're gonna need 24 sticks. Our 5 for the 20 inches times it by 5 per tree, 
25 sticks. Our two 28 inch trees need 10 sticks each, total of 20. We add that together, we get 68 sticks for the trees, for the charges. Now we also need to add in there our kickers that goes on the opposite side of the tree. Well, we got 15 charges, 15 trees, so we need to add 15 in there for our kickers. So our total explosives we would need to put in this particular abatis is 84 sticks of M112C4 block explosives, or C4 sticks. Now, uh, there is a little bit of a difference on this. If you're calculating for steel cutting, the calculation for it is already made for C4, and that when you do those, you eliminate this step. You, you just go right into calculating for C4. <coughs> there is no RE factor you need to take into uh, account that's already been done in the calculation. But your other types of charges like your abatis, your internal timber cutting, external timber cutting, your stump removals, quarrying, and yes, I see I got a misspelling here, so don't worry about it. Don't point it out. I just noticed it. Uh, also, your road craters, all that is put, a lot gets uh, figured out through the six-step problem-solving format. This format is something you need to have inside your notebooks for your quick reference. Now, for all my engineer brothers and the Patriot and Militia Movements, Always remember, essay ons.